there will be a huge employment boom in less than two years in 2026 the production and everything should be starting estimation right. of direct uh, places at mm -hmm. this uh, plant is 3000 people estimation of, of indirect is 10000 people they will rely on very close collaboration cooperation with uh, technical university in kosice mm -hmm. if you're like uh, studying here there's very high chance that you might end up in a job uh, in uh, uh, at Volvo because when you study here you get this access to the labor market in Europe or in Slovakia I myself am a mechanical engineer I studied uh, from technical university today had really good uh, experience studying over there hello Dobrije and welcome to study in Slovakia today we are standing at the Valeriki site of the Volvo plant. Maybe you have heard already that there is going to be a Volvo plant for production of cars in Slovakia, in Košice to be specific, right here. And we are standing in the uh, location over there. By 2026, there will be like hundreds of thousands of cars produced from this uh, place, thousands of workers working here. And today we are going to dive deep into what's going to happen and what the project looks like and what's the opportunity that it brings for students, internationals and everyone around it. So thanks, Mr. Peter, for joining uh, the video. He is the owner and the uh, CEO of Study in Slovakia. And today he will be giving us some insight about what Volvo is looking for, what it's uh, planning, and how does this area completely change. This is like maybe like uh, 10 kilometers from Slovakia, uh, from mm -hmm. Košice. Mm -hmm. So like, let's say something around like 15 minutes by car. So how this complete area is going to transform as well. So, Mr. Peter, first things first, uh, let's start with uh, what Volvo's plans are with the production unit, what type of cars it's going to produce, how, uh, what is the annual capacity and stuff. This uh, factory, which we see behind us, like it will uh, produce 250,000 electrical cars uh, each year. What is interesting that all the uh, energy that uh, will be used here will be also produced from the electric, uh, from the renewable, uh, source renewable energies like solar panels and so on. And uh, this is the third uh, factory of uh, Volvo in uh, in uh, Europe after uh, Hent and uh, Tolslanda in Sweden. Uh, after they build this uh, factory, they would like to sell. Uh, around 1.2 uh, million cars per year. So this is their uh, step toward reaching this goal and also step toward being green company. This was a very big uh, news, like I think a couple of years back, right? Uh, so Košice signed this uh, deal with Volvo and it's going to bring a lot of uh, opportunity. So if you know already some details about Košice, so uh, Košice's uh, biggest employer and the biggest production unit is US Steel. Uh, I think more than 10,000 people are working there and there are like several of these automobile production hubs here. So like uh, direct producers as well as like uh, suppliers, uh, let's say for uh, parts, batteries, manufacturing uh, things and um, uh, units and all of those things. And Volvo is going to be one of those. So we expect also with the Volvo, there will be uh, like, let's say uh, other companies that will be like uh, uh, the suppliers, the vendors and so on for Volvo, which also will be employing. So there will be a huge employment boom in less than two years in 2026. The production and everything should be starting. The construction is that's why uh, on full scale uh, in the swing. So we expect that there's going to be a mass uh, recruitment and everything. What's the number of employees that uh, Volvo, let's say, is giving an estimation of employing? Estimation right. of direct uh, places at mm -hmm. this uh, plant is 3000 people. Estimation of indirect is 10,000 people. Mm -hmm. uh, primarily, they would like to give opportunity to local workers, mm -hmm. but also uh, they are uh, planning or they will rely on very close collaboration, cooperation with uh, technical university in Košice mm -hmm. So definitely. if you're like uh, studying here, there's very high chance that you might end up in a job uh, in uh, uh, at Volvo so like uh, generally if you know like the story of most of these industrial hubs around the globe it always starts from one of the universities or a few universities in a in a city and then the uh, production uh, houses or whatever that, that was even the story of Silicon Valley with Stanford and everything so it means like generally where there is university there is talent and definitely it's easier to uh, open up something over there and then you get like a uh, good talent over there so there's going to be a huge employment boom in general and it's the the 
ideal time for that reason to uh, to come here in Slovakia, especially in the, this year, so that by 2026, when you graduate, you can already be one of the first employees entering this uh, factory behind us. Yeah, we also saw, uh, as uh, we both are local experts now in Berlitz, <laughs> we saw that uh, they have now opened recruitment um, uh, head base yes. in uh, Aupark, the biggest, uh, or next to Aupark, the biggest uh, shopping mall in Košice. So, yeah, so the, yeah, so there is uh, actually it's not the biggest. I think it's the second biggest, but like mm -hmm. biggest, I think is Optima. Okay. But uh, like uh, the good part is like uh, that's the corporate office, and this is going to be the production unit. So there's going to be both parts of the works. So there's going to be the management, administration, and all of that, as well as the production work. So the engineers and the site inspectors, process uh, R and D, everything, and it's going to be all EVs. And as you uh, mentioned, uh, that it's going to be all renewable. So. Also, this is a good part because the city stays fresh, the environment stays good. In long term, if you want to settle here, that's also like a, a great opportunity. Especially like this area, Valeriki, which is about 10 kilometers from Košice. It's still in Košice region, but uh, like this place, the real estate and everything is going to boom. And right now also there are like several projects going. You can maybe light some um, some light on uh, the details about the projects here. Yeah, we can uh, see also when we move in a city, many, um, many, many uh, places where there were um, like, um, where, which were used for uh, as working places. Now they're being reconstructed for the flats, mm -hmm. like either smaller flats or the big, bigger flats. Uh, so we see like thousands of new apartments being constructed in Košice, but also close one to Valaliki, uh, where there will be even new villages. Uh, coming to existence yeah. because uh, in this uh, factory, the estimation expenses is 1.2 billion. Uh, yeah, yeah. So it's an uh, incredible number, incredible project, uh, the biggest, uh, definitely biggest project in uh, Eastern Slovakia mm -hmm. in the last uh, 50 to 70 years. So the, now I think is the ideal time to consider uh, studying in Slovakia. Definitely. Studying, working, everything is going to be like uh, super fine quality and also like if you want to buy apartment or something because eventually the prices are going to go uh, up much higher because um, like as you mentioned like 10,000 uh, workers plus added like uh, other let's say uh, industries that are going to support that so there's going to be plenty of flow and their families as well so as we were discussing here is uh, the corporate office of volvo uh, in koshetse so uh, the place we showed you previously was uh, the production unit the uh, the factories and all of these and here is the corporate office and it's not only the office uh, of Volvo but it also has offices of IBM, Accenture and some more uh, so mostly like IT companies around here this is in the city center just behind the Opark mall and that's a uh, uh, the production unit is about 10 kilometers away from uh, here so yeah like uh, the corporate office is going to grow right now it's the team is comparatively smaller but like it's gonna grow uh, to much larger scale once the production and everything is starting but in general, the uh, industry in Slovakia for mechanical and uh, let's say manufacturing and everything is really huge, automobile especially. It's not only in the uh, in Western uh, Slovakia like Bratislava, Tarnava with Stellantis and all of these companies, but also in Eastern Slovakia, starting from US Steel, which is the biggest employer in Košice, there are like many more. You can get like uh, even your traineeship, your final completion of the uh, thesis and uh, the defense also you can like uh, complete it at a uh, at a particular firm with a particular topic as well. So it's like a great experience in general. And Mr. Peter helps you a lot with that. So uh, in general, the industry is like quite thriving. There is going to be this 10,000 plus job openings from Volvo and uh, also added uh, more like industries around it. So I think in general, there is going to be like a lot of scope uh, especially Košice has this perfect arrangement that, uh, you know, there is university, so the talent is graduating. And then there are companies and the industrial parks, which are like uh, hiring those students as well. So uh, if you are starting to study right now, like let's say in 2024, so in two years you can complete your bachelor's or like in three years your master's. By that time you can expect like there's going to be this 
huge boom because of uh, 2026 volvo is starting its official production 2026 or 7 you can actually like get this huge boom and be one of the first workers working at volvo or even like uh, any of the other firms as well so and yes it's very important uh, in general to study in slovakia or uh, in europe because when you study here you get this access to the labor market in europe or in slovakia i myself am a mechanical engineer i studied uh, from technical university had really good uh, experience studying over there and uh, after completion it was like yeah i had access to the uh, job market and the labor market so it means like when the hrs they check the cv they see the phone number like the country code and also the location and when they see it's like uh, from somewhere else like other than the country they're mostly thinking after that like okay you know like uh, we have to do a huge paperwork with a visa and everything when it comes uh, to uh, like if you're already student it's much easier for them to uh, do the paperwork if, when you're physically here also you can travel to the office there is no problem for any sort of like huge relocation and stuff so it's much uh, easier for them to make the consideration with you based on your profile so that's the major thing so anyway um, uh, in general Slovakia is really booming, uh, especially in automobile. It's the per capita highest producer of automobile, uh, if you knew that. So uh, that's why automobile sector or manufacturing mechanical sector has huge number of jobs here. Uh, if you have any questions regarding any particular company or employment opportunities in Slovakia, mechanical industry, Volvo project and everything, feel free to comment it down. Uh, any other suggestions uh, for videos we should cover. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, share it with someone who's planning to uh, study in Europe, study in Slovakia, work in Europe. This can be really helpf helpful for them because right now there's a trend that uh, many companies from the West are moving uh, their uh, offices to uh, Slovakia and Czech Republic and uh, these countries because uh, the labor is much more affordable here and uh, on uh, in the West it's uh, more expensive. So they want to still produce in Europe but uh, for uh, like a better affordability and everything they want to consider it so that's one of the primary reason and subscribe to our channel for such nice content uh until next time see you dovidenia and hope to see you actually at volvo or somewhere in koshitse uh, in less than a couple of years working in some good firm see you around take care bye 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 bye